Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Let's Play Rayman 3 Hoodlum Havoc. I'm Zeros Got Your Host, and what the heck is that kind of machine? It's like a three legged robot thing that is crawling into the water, it seems. Well, good thing I know we're not going after that, because that would be dangerous. Wait, what? Wait, wait. We're, we're not going after that, right? I mean. We all know that that would be way too dangerous to do. Give me a drink or I start nibbling his arteries! You know what? There's a drink over there. Take it and shut up. You know, I'm getting kind of sick of it. Yeah, see? See? I knew it. Well... Happy, uh, whatever you're... Okay, I guess happy, uh, flight glow box. Check it out, Raven! I'm flying! This rules! At least he's happy? Whatever. Okay, and we apparently have to go under the water, so... Yep, we are probably going to face that giant thing we saw. So yeah, about the swimming controls on this game. You have no control over the heights. You only control the... I believe it's the X-axis and the z-axis depends on which game some games make the y-axis the up and down other games make the y-axis one of the horizontal axi and there it is already that was quick well i guess that's our boss for this uh... this world and it lets out some sort of fish and that shoots mini fish if ate the mini fish so yeah, you can do a backflip if you press any button, and uh, as you can see, that'll make those guys shoot and hit that guy inside the robot. And that really is how you have to do it to beat him. However, then he closes his mouth and he starts shooting a laser. And you can very easily evade the laser by simply doing backflips. Even if it looks like it would hit you, it still doesn't. Because apparently during your backflip, you are completely invulnerable. Okay, done. And those things, uh, those rocket fish are being shot by the mechanical piranha. So, just so you know where they come from. It's constantly on the screen though, so... Yeah. It, it just, it follows you. Boom! Ah, uh, yeah, I knew it would hit. Yeah! No, no, ah, uh, I couldn't hit him one more time. Hit him, baby, one more time. Nah, I won't sing. I will spare you the agony of hearing me sing, because, honestly, being completely honest here, I cannot sing. It's one of those things that I am simply incapable of. Well, they say everyone can sing. No, that's a big fat lie. Just like not everyone can program, not everyone can draw. There are just some things that some people can do and other people can't. It's all, it's all a matter of finding... Oh, I already beat that guy. It's all a matter of finding out what can I do. So, you get 1500 points for that. Yay, us. And then there are some gems for you to collect. So I'll quickly collect them and see if they can give me enough points so that the game considers me to have 100% score on this stage. Let's swim. We can't swim through there. That's weird. Ooh, one more gem. There we go. Anyway, um, yes, let us continue. Swim inside and go through here. The rest of this isn't all too interesting. I mean, once you're up here, you're out of the water. And there's Glowbox. Raven, you're the coolest ever, and you're my bestest friend. And you're my bestest friend! I didn't know it was possible to be so lame. Whatever. Drink. Just follow me, guys. Yep. Especially your glow bucks since you can walk. 99%? Really? Game? Do you hate me that much? Apparently you do. 
This game hates me, people. It really hates me. It's hurting my feelings. Oh well. So what can we do here? Well, apparently it's all shock record time. Woo! Boom, that's one. Boom, that's two. Ah, oh, I missed. No, oh, I'm... Nope. Oh, well. Boom. And then there's that guy. Boom. There has to be... Oh, whoops. One more somewhere around here. There we are. No, oh, yet don't. Victory for me. Oh, gee. Is there anything else? I mean, this can't be everything, right? I mean, just doing this, it feels kind of lame. And this time, there is no secret entrance back there. Except that I do think there is. However, there's a little secret to it. I believe it has to do with shock rockets. Oh, look up there. There's something up there. Yep. Nope. Dang it. Come on. Work, work. So close. Shock rocket! Shock rocket, go! Yes! Now what did that do? Seriously, that must have done something. There, there's another one over there, isn't there? Well, let's do that one. Yep, there's another one up there. So let's see if we can hit that. Yeah! Awesome sauce. Right. Yes, it makes me happy too, Raymond. So, that'll give me a nice amount of points. Let's go to the uh, doctor. No, no, no way I'm going back there. Nope, that doctor gives me the creeps. <coughs> Ow! Forgive them! Raymond, wait up! Yeah. I thought he would, uh... Would come. All right. Whoa. Yay! Stereotypical hippie doctor. Awesome. Dude, still in bed? Well, must have been a late night. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> My colleague explained everything. <laughs> wow, seems like you swallowed a black lump. Major mm. bummer. <laughs> You see, black lums reproduce like some kind of crazy weed. <laughs> They're really wacky. <laughs> Let's see if we can, uh, you know, hook you up with something to take the pain away, huh? <laughs> How's that sound? <laughs> Hold on a sec here. Hmm. Oh, yeah. can be done. The black lum has like totally lodged himself in your brain, see? And the problem is, I can't find it. But I know a guy who can help you. He's like a specialist in like hollow cavities, and he lives in the desert of the Canarin. Well, gotta go. Need to go water my plants. I don't think those are normal plants. Oh well. So... More Funky Board time, and sadly this is the final Funky Board section of the entire game, so let us enjoy it. Let's enjoy the epic funky music and the funky boardness of funkiness or something. Woo! Riding. Yeah. Hopefully this time we won't get, uh... We will make it to our destination. The desert of the Kanaran. Sounds dangerous. So let us go there. Oh yeah. I, 
I simply don't have any commentary for these sections. I mean, the music, man, the music. Enjoy it. Box, I'm sure of it. Though knowing where they dump us, it will be a bit of a ways before we actually get to the doctor himself. No matter though. Whoa, we're in space. I mean, these are just really like the tunnels of trippiness or something. How incredibly trippy is this place? I mean, just look at it. All the shiny lights and such and Disco music and such. I don't know. Sort of worth it. I hope I'm not set back too much. Because I would like to end this section now, even though the music is awesome. I would like to, you know, beat this stuff and get on with the rest of the game. Since there's still a lot more game to be had. Yes, indeed. There we go. The end is near. I mean, you can see it right there. 100% level score. Yeah. Ah, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, this burns! Quick, get in the shade! And we're in the desert of the Canaran. And it looks dangerous. Why do all these places look so dangerous? No, 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 not the sand. No, the sand is incredibly painful. As you can see, that did a lot of damage. Good. Yeah, the, the sand really does do a shit ton of damage. So, best to avoid it. There we go. And we have to get to that skull, it seems. I stand on the bones, they're not as hot as the incredibly hot sand. Grab that and go down. Okay, this looks fun. Whoa, what kind of stuff is that green goo? Yeah. Don't even want to know, I think. Better not touch it. Well, the music is... Will you grant me one final request? Find me some plum juice, please! Well, he has his plum juice, so that's great. Good thing is, we probably won't have to worry about him this way. 
and she'll probably make it since he's intoxicated with plum juice. No, 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 no. Those things and this goo. No, it's some. I, I'm guessing it's some kind of sulfuric acid or something. Some sort of acid, at least. Let us just. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's see where we need to go first. We need to go to there. Okay. Easy does it. And go. Yeah, you really have to fly from throttle copter to throttle copter. Alright, let's see. There's one of those guys. And some piggy banks. They might contain something. And they did. Good. Alright, so let's see if we can get back to that autocopter. Okay. And get to that autocopter. Yes! Piggy bank. Do you contain something? Yes, you do. These ones are too far apart, so you'll have to jump. Oh, that looks like a place I should go. Yep. Alright, there we go. Shock rockets. Go! Whoa, that went very bad. There we go. Ah, we well saved some tinsies. And they are normal clothed tinsies for once. Amazing. So, uh, let us go back and see if we can grab our little lockjaw just in case. I mean, I could have probably made it, but you know, lockjaw, because it's awesome. If you want to cross the desert, you need to use the tunnels. But it won't be easy. The tunnels are swarming with Canarin, and those beasts are invincible. Yeah, well, you got a better idea? You bet your bet um dollar I do. Okay, listen closely, Big Nose. Do not let the Canarin get near you. You understand? Never! If they get their claws on you, you're dead. Well, it was a nice knowing ya! Well, I can't say the same for you, really. Oh, well. At least they were nice enough to give me one or some of that. And... Whoa! And your face... Wow, Glowbox's mouth really glitched there. Real bad. I believe... Yeah, you wait there, Glowbox. I'll be right there. If I wasn't mistaking... Yeah, that's gone now. It, I, it was that cage. Oh well, let us just go. Whoa! Not good. Let me go! Oh crap, that looks like a Canarin. Poking him in the... Hey, no poking in my eyes. Thank you very much. Oh, there he is. Oh, crap. They really are invincible. So, yeah, like that Tinsy said, do not let them get near you. Let us escape. Help! 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 Oh. Crap. This all looks very dangerous. So, grabbing ourselves some life over here. Stick bamboo under his nails. Ah, oh, come on, that's just inhumane. Sticking bamboo under someone's nail? Eat better with salt. Yeah, so. They truly are invincible, since this... Stop shouting those, uh, those threats. Those aren't very friendly. So... 
I've gotten... Alright, now, the secrets to the Canarin. I mean, you saw that one guy hitting that gong, right? Well, there's another gong right here, and if you hit it... Then they'll run over to it... To see what is happening. So, I have no idea that way. Good. Now, I will have to hit it again, since this is taking way too long. Let's wait until the guy gets back, and then we can hit the gong one more time, and then we should be able to get past there. So let's let's hit it right now. As you can see, it goes towards it. Alright. Climbing up, grabbing a lockjaw, and going up. Well, that's not too bad. Just do spit. Alright, and run. Run, 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 run. And drop down. Ouch. And get hurt, apparently. That's great. Oh, hey. It's a coconut egg something. Oh, no. No, I broke it. Ghost chickens from the second game. Just die. Sure, they will annoy you while you try to get this thing on a button. And there they are again. Alright, other button. There we go. Grab this again. Walk back. Alright, there we go. Get ourselves some gems. And a shock rocket. Let's gong that dude. And get down here. Yeah! Now he will not know we're here. Alright. It seemed like there was some important stuff down there. So let's grab it. Tons of points. That's cool. Escape! Alrighty then! Where are we now? More of those. Oh no, crap! Dang it! There. Same for you and you. You. Oh, and those guys! So many of them! The problem is they keep coming back. So, once again, we have to take one of these things without getting hit, because if we get hit, we break it. We don't want to break it. There we go. Uh, these parts always make me so nervous, because those guys can appear at any time. So, let us just continue and try to get this to that darn button. I do wonder, though, in a desert that's inhabited by these stone-like creatures that are pretty that are pretty much invincible why are there chicken ghosts I mean that's just weird anyway we'll talk about that later because I will see you guys because we'll end the episode here and I'll see you guys later next time for more let's play Rayman 3 Hoodlum Havoc goodbye